Hello! This is my third video on how to vanquish Samsung's nasty drag the lock icon to unlock feature, which will probably mess up something you're trying to accomplish with your device. It suddenly breaks in and it just blanks out the screen. This is the best and probably the most reliable means to either vanquish the feature or make it a much longer time before it activates. I have got comments from previous other videos I've done on this feature which has helped me understand the feature more and perhaps come up with a method that should be able to be used on more devices. Now, I have got my Samsung Galaxy Tab S6 here with Nova Launcher, so it has an app drawer. There's a particular app we have to access. I am presently offline. If you're having trouble accessing this app, which is now in the top left corner of the screen called Game Launcher. It's a purple square with the uh, X's and the O's in it. X and O's in it. I'll tap on it just to put a dialog underneath the icon so you can highlight it in case English isn't your first language and you're having trouble understanding this video. That is the app you're going to have to get into. If you're having trouble finding that app, I would suggest going online and using Samsung's App Store or the Galaxy Store to access it by searching for the words up in the top left corner, Game Launcher or Game Booster. And going down the entry it will have on that page to something to the effect of Start App or Launch App. There will be a button by a dialogue somewhere there. And you can get to it that way as well if you can't find the icon on your device to enter it. Now, I don't have touch activated on this screen. And we are going to need to go into the settings for Game Launcher. To get there, there's a, like a little N inside of an orange circle with the menu or the hamburger behind that. It's up in the top left corner. I am going to touch that and your game launcher could look a little different than mine depending on what game you have, games you have installed on your device. Don't worry about that. The thing we want to go into is the menu in the top left corner. So I'm going to touch that now. This will bring up Game Launcher and some of the options there. Now, the option we want to go into is Game Performance. The names and all of the, to get to the final feature we want to get to are dra drastically different on various different parts of the Samsung system, so I hope you can find a, fee a line called Game Performance. I'm going to touch that now to highlight it. For those that have difficulty understanding this video, it is now highlighted with a grayish background, and we will go into it as soon as I release my finger. We are now in a different app. You don't know it's a different app. It's an add-on to Game Launcher. It's an app called Game Booster, and we're in its settings. You can see it says Game Booster, whereas previously it said Game Launcher up in the top left corner. I'm going to hit the recent Android Recent button down the bottom of the screen just to show you. It's two different apps.
You can see the icon we started with in the lower part of the screen, and the new icon, which you will probably not be able to very easily find unless you look at my previous videos on how to get to this feature. And it's a bit confusing that one's called Game Launcher and one's called Game Booster. Now, we have options in here. We don't want to look at all these other options. And here the names can be something different than you'll understand what the feature was from somewhere else you've seen what this feature supposedly is. The feature we want to go into is called, is the second one down there, called Touch Protect Time Out, and it's currently set to the factory time that I had on my tablet of three minutes. That may vary if you have a phone, it could be set to a shorter period of time. So I'm going to touch touch protection timeout to highlight it and hold it just for a few seconds so I can help those that don't really understand that my language of English too well to navigate through this video. We now have various different times we can choose from including a never down at the bottom. If you want to completely vanquish the drag the lock icon and never see it again on your device, tap the never. It now says never on my line here, and that feature will not come up again. It is completely disabled, and it will show the various other times we have here. If you have a phone which has it set to factory set to 15, 30 seconds or a minute, you could change it to a longer time and still preserve your battery some, as opposed to completely turning it off. If you're using a tablet, you're probably not quite as worried about your battery problems. And we've got never. So I'd like to thank those that helped me understand this feature more, and that it is an add-on to a previous app to get to the ability to adjust it. And that... It does not always present the same way on every device, and this has got to be a, sh a much shorter way of getting to that feature to disable it. So to all those who made comments to my previous videos on how to disable this feature, thank you. If you've got problems with this setup, or want to make a comment otherwise that it works for you, please leave a comment down below. So I'm going to call out a video and I hope it helps you do something about this annoying Samsung feature. That's it for now.